Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Star Sector. Wow, uh, yeah, we were in the middle of a chase. We want to chase these guys down, because they're low, they're resupplying. Which means that their combat readiness is low, and we've got our ship. Our fleet's a lot faster than them, so let's do this. We can show off our new little ship as well, with the new equipment. I wonder if I could do that like, in the future, like some mining stuff, like be able to mine asteroids and stuff. Ooh, hello, there we go, Adam. Right, see ya. Yeah. I cannot even field those fighters. Uh, actually, no, that's fine. It's a perfectly accessible ship, but that is not. Um, they're slightly lower on combat readiness, but we will do it anyway. Are we willing to join the battle? Fine. Let us fight them off. Let's take both ships in. Or maybe we can also show off the um, in game interface. Like, there's a second ship, and the AI for the ships is not bad. It joins in. Uh, there's not much to, to, to do because there's no points need capturing. You could easily tell this guy for him to do some point capturing. But you don't really have to. Uh, I've actually wasted all of my command points. Um, yep, so lol. The waste for that. Anyway. Oh god. I'm not even going to be taking part in this time. Oh, hello. Enjoy. Dodge that one. Boom, dead. Uh, which means we can try to now stop these other guys. Uh, come on, quick, 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 quick. Nope, we're not catching them up. They're fleeing and we can't really stop them. So yeah, that was a good, quick battle. Uh, we immediately managed to... we're gonna stand down, there's no point in chasing um, some fleet ships, we can let them go. Uh, we can pick through the salvage, see what we get. More stuff for us. Um, we're over here, go back to Corvus to sell. Uh, they're pursuing our fleet, no, 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 oh crap. This might be a problem. <laughs> this might be an issue, because they've got a lot of ships. They've got They've got the mule combat freighter as well, so that's a destroyer class, like, with shields. Like, these are destroyer classes technically, but they haven't got shields. That's got shields. And it's got a huge mining laser as well. So, this might be a problem. Um, but we're gonna try and see what we can do. Hopefully he'll come in as well. He's a slight, he's a bit damaged in the armor front, I think. Nope, he's actually been repaired. But we want to deal with these guys first, because we can. Right, okay, so let's dodge them. Okay. Can just, <laughs> it makes it very hectic, but we can just dodge everything that we get sent. It's it sent our way. Oh, nope, that's our... Our uh, friend has been disabled. Not surprised. It's unfortunate I'm not surprised. Oh god, we're gonna, we're gonna run out of face shields pretty soon as well, which is annoying. Nope. God. We are gonna get hit hard, aren't we? Alright, dodging again. Okay, dodge those again. Right, we're fleeing. As best as we can. Ah, uh, God. We're running, we're running for our lives. Uh, hang on, it's okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So what we got on our tail? We got the fighters. Do you want to run away? Because we're currently at the edge of the map, so we could run away if we wanted to. If we went, if we went here and engaged full retreat, we could run away. I'm just deciding if we want to do that. I've got a brand new ship that I want to keep.
Oh, I've only got 55 seconds of operating of peak operating time left anyway. So, I think yes, we want to run away. What we're going to do is we are going to run away. Oh, no, whoops, wrong button. Oh, ah, ah. Full retreat. From the bottom edge. What do we mean bottom edge? Damn it! I'm on the wrong. I'm on the wrong edge of the map. This is unfortunate. This is unfortunate. Oh God. No, that was bad, that was bad, that was bad, that was bad. That was bad. <laughs> oh god, that was horrible. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I gotta spin around. I gotta spin around. No, 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 no. <sighs> Yeah, I know, I'm well aware. I'm well aware. Vent, 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 vent. Speed boost, let's get out. Wow, that was bad. That was bad. Oh, 55 hull left. Oh, and I keep forgetting I've got flare launchers. Specifically for the purpose of stopping missiles that are trying to catch me up. I'm not going back in. There's no way I'm going back in. A single shot from like a, a assault gun will completely end me. If it hits and if it hits an unarmored part, which is most of it, a single shot from a assault gun. Okay, so now you get to see what happens if you retreat combat or if you lose combat, which I did. Um, unfortunately, we are gonna have to disengage. The Harrier retreat. Our combat readiness is low, we leave, but now it means that our boost, our burn will be huge. Yeah, we get a huge boost to our burn. Our huge boost to our burn rate, that's a weird sentence to say out loud. Um, because running away, it was his, gets a, they get a penalty to their burn rate down to one. But yeah, they've definitely won out this engagement, so we're gonna, we will flee back to our home base. The reason they caught us up in the first place is because we just won combat, and therefore our speed was won. Okay, we're, we're slowly repairing away. Full repairs require 57 supplies. For the full repairs require 52 supplies, only 44 are available. That's fine, not a problem at all. We can put this, these things away to make some space for us. Um, Put those supplies in there. Repair the ships. Oh, we need to keep 25. Uh, this, we got way too much crew as well. And that's the Marines. We got the Marines. The Marines are far too much. In fact. Yep. Wow, that's bad, bad news, man. We lost a lot of men on the other ship. A lot of men on the other ship. We've been set back quite a bit, I will say, by losing that one. Uh, that's quite a big loss for us. So we need to start recouping our losses. That's what you do. You get hit. Try again. Uh, yep. Yeah. We can deal with you. A buffalo and some fighters. The fighters are the big, our big issue, bigger issue now because we haven't really got an effective point defense. We've got one point defense laser. Come on! A uh, one point defense laser, which is not a huge um, boon for fighter attacks. Well, the flares do their business, hopefully. Two flares. Okay, let's let's pummel this guy from the front then. Yeah, man, the blaster, let the blaster down. Right, that's them down. I think we won, technically. Oh god. The fighters are retreating. I can't really stop them. I can try. 
Okay, one. Two. Won't be able to get that one. Get this one. Three. And that fighter is fleeing. Is he fleeing? He's fleeing. I can't catch up to him. My speed is 233, his speed is 250-ish. So he'll outrun me. All he has is a frag Vulcan cannon anyway, so it's not much of a problem. But anyway, that's the end of that battle. Uh, send out the salvage teams. Let them go. Pick through the salvage. Get loads of stuff. Take it back to our base. That's what we're doing. Get loads of stuff, take it back to our base. Get loads of stuff, take it back to our base. So we can, for example, we can put the missiles in, another Vulcan cannon. 25 supplies. We've been to full combat readiness and we can carry on. Uh, those are the guys we were just beating? Yeah, those are the guys we were just beating. That one fighter who's left. Um, okay, what else have we got? What are you? But we took a pummeling. That was unfortunate. We need to start building up more forces. We need more forces. How much money have we got? 26,000. Uh, not too shabby. Not sure what they're doing. They're going quite fast as well. Let's see if by the end of this video... I don't, see if, I don't know if I'll be able to, but at the end of this video, go see the other system. What are you? There you are. What are you? You are a hound class. Okay, I can't actually catch up. I can't actually catch up to you. You were the kind of ship that was that we had that was destroyed. Beep. Good. Um, grab you. Move into engage. Again, because they've got he's got a heavy mauler. I have to phase out of the heavy mauler shots, or I will get wrecked. I think to be out of phase until I'm in this back arc, essentially. I won't be able to, like, he's staying clear of me. Wow, this might be a bit of a trouble, actually. I got a vent. That hurts a lot. That hurts a lot. I'm not going to be able to keep out of him because he's got he's a lot faster than I am. 184, maybe. I gotta I've gotta get behind him. I gotta get behind him. I gotta get into his blind arc. He's not gonna let me, is he? So that's bad. He's, I'm not gonna be able to do anything around him. Oh 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 no. Oh, maybe, maybe. Now he turned around. Okay, let's unload. Railgun disabled. Heavy ball disabled. Yes, there we go. I don't believe they had a juking it out match. Ah, come on. Yes. Oh, that was close. Juking it out, match. It's like I have to disable your heavy mauler before you hit disable my weapons. Uh, stand down, guys. Ooh, kind of want to board that. Nope. Blow it to pieces. Blow it to pieces. Uh, get our that back. Get some more fuel. Uh, let's go drop that off. Um, yeah, this is the closest place. Let's go drop that off. Ooh, we can level up. Sweet. Oh, we got two spool, two skill points to spend. Wow, I missed that completely. Um, two skill points, huh? Uh, we can put, um, we can put a point into lead targeting for auto-firing weapons, makes auto-firing weapons better, and we can also improve our engine damage taken. Because one of the things, for example, is that, um, when you hit level 5, you get the next stability down, so when you hit level 5 in this, we'll have evasion, which is plus 75 maneuverability, which is good for heavy ships. This one gives us 
uh, maximum power, which means you get a plus 25 to speed boost granted at zero flux. Which means that you know that if you're at zero flux, you get plus 50 to your speed, that gives you plus 75. Once you hit 10 in Hell's Moon Ship, you get to Dynamic Civilization, which gives you the boost up to 25% flux, which means you can you can actually go around with your speed boost and your shield on at the same time, which is fantastic. Um, and target analysis, which double damage to enemy weapons and engines, also pretty good. Uh, everything's good. Everything is good. Um, Let's go for minus sixteen percent engine damage taken. Wow, I just realized at level ten this is gonna be minus eighty percent engine damage taken. Which will be pretty good actually for avoiding flame outs and such and such like. Uh, right, are we still flying back to our base? Back to base. Oh no, uh That's Corvus two. Uh Corvus one Corvus, it's Corvus two, fine. Corvus two is orbiting our way anyway. We'll intercept it when it comes around. Whoa. I'm trying to remember what uh, destroyer I was using. So I was utilizing a destroyer, and I can't remember which it was. Um. Repair their ships, please. We sell. We can sell quite a bit of the fuel. We can sell quite a lot of our fuel because I don't care for the fuel very much. Um, and we can sell eleven supplies. No, no, ten supplies. Right. Um, get some big guns here. These are some large ballistic weapons. Hellbore gun, Mark Nine auto cannons. Cyclone Reaper launcher, which is, fires off two huge torpedoes, which if they get hit, do no damage. But if they hit you, my god, do they hurt! Four thousand damage, and it fires two of them. Um, okay, let's look. Let's look. Look around. Cause we want a destroyer. We want to. We want to class up a bit. Um, you could get a hammerhead, a hammerhead I guess. But no, I, w I want I want to build up a smaller fleet first of all. I want to have a, a big, uh, more dynamic, smaller fleet. And let's get a lasher then. Let's grab let's grab a couple of lashers. We get a couple of lashers. Um, and can we do them up nicely? Uh, let's refit them. Lasher one is going to be variant. You're going to be a. What's the assault variant? Oh, no, we cannot make an assault variant because we need weapons. We have not got the weapons. Can we make a standard variant? Nope, again, no, because we haven't got light assault guns. We can't make those mods. Fine, anyway, let's strip, in fact. Let's strip out completely and see what we can make. Small ballistics. Um, fine, stick a couple of light mortars there for now. Uh, small missile hardpoints. We're gonna do. We're gonna stick you with a couple of harpoons. And this is gonna be Vulcan. Uh, Vulcan cannon. We only got one Vulcan cannon. That's unfortunate. Um, yeah, that is, that is horribly unfortunate. In fact. Um, so okay, that's that's gonna be you. We have two Vulcan cannons in our base, so we can put the Vulcan cannons there. We've got that sorted out. What are you gonna have? That's gonna be our, our, our salty kind of thing. Um, what we can put for you? We can put more of you. Uh, we'll put some light machine guns and some harpoons again. Cool. That's kind of done for you. Um, you want some expanded magazines so you can actually have weapons to fire with. Want to give you. Um, That's fine. Give you some more shield capacitors. Uh, we got another ten points to spend. Ten points to spend. We can give you um, hardened subsystems and blast doors. Hardened subsystems um, means you take less damage. You, you can be outside for longer, 
and you lose combat readiness slower, and blast doors means you have hull increase and reduces crew casualties, which is again useful. So we can do that for both of you. You can also take expanded magazines, and you know, that's these four OP. So we need to clear up another eight. So we need 42 here. So we're gonna lose. What we're we gonna lose? We're gonna lose three capacitors. No, three, two capacitors in an event. Good, and then we're gonna head back to our uh, base. Uh, we need fleet. Yeah, we need we need a lot of more crew. We need more crew and more things. We're gonna grab. We need 55 crew. Can we grab about a hundred men? Six thousand credits. There you go. Good. There you go. We have a good crew. We have supplies in our base. We have fuel in our base. We can refit up and cape. Okay, we have a little fleet now. We have a small little fleet of ships that hopefully will not get us killed. We wanted light assault guns for these, but the mortars will have to do for now. Uh, back to Corvus. Oh god, they're pursuing my fleet. They can, they can go away. So what have they got? What have they got? They've got a buffalo, a freighter, two uh, two services, a lasher, a hound, a bomber wing, an Italian interceptor wing. Things I do not want. Um, yeah, anyway, uh, so we can get some few more supplies. We can give this guy the Vulcans he needs. So he has this guy's same thing that he's got heavy machine guns but the Vulcans. And that's fine for us, so okay. They're fleeing because they got their ass their, their asses handed to them. Oh god. No, we need to keep running because these guys are chasing us. Um, nope, these guys. Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Again, tempted. I keep getting tempted to take these things on. I, I probably could, actually. I probably could. But I will not give it a chance. I'm not. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take it easy. I, I bit more than I could do last time. See, that guy I can kill by myself if I have to. What we're going to do is we're going to... Um, attempting to disengage. Okay, he's attempting to disengage. He's actively trying to run away. So we will take personal command for this action. We're going to deploy all of them. But for example, I can now choose to deploy him left and him right. Because he's fleeing, we get a more choice of deployment, and smaller ships can be deployed from the side. So if I deploy them all, we get ships coming here and here. And I can say, for example, Navboy, you need to want, you want that, and you chase that him down. And we will go for the nav boy first of all. We'll go for the nav boy. Once we have the nav boy, which will give us the speed we require, we'll carry on after him. Also, through the orders, like we said, because you said capture that, like our ships, no matter what ships they are, will specifically, because you can tell a specific ship to capture something. That's fine. They'll do it. But if we click a point and say capture, that point will try to be captured by ships that are around it. If we lose control, ships will automatically task themselves to go back and capture it. Okay, flares. Okay, we have a lot of... a lot of... Uh, nav boy deployed at Alpha, huh? Cancel that. Okay, we've cancelled that, so he doesn't have the speed he has, he wants anymore. Nav boy deployed at gamma. Nav boy deployed at alpha, so we have plus thirty to our top speed, plus fifty percent of maneuverability, so we're fast and really maneuverable now. Because nav boys do that apparently. And he's got pummeled. You win. 
you came in to join the fun. That was good. That was very, very good. It was smooth. It was coordinated. We'll send out the salvage teams. We'll pick up the stuff. Another Vulcan cannon. Um, yes, yeah, keep getting Vulcan cannons. Uh, can you raid this guy as well? Yeah, we got him. Oh. Move in and engage. Okay, neutral posture, so we're not chasing them down, and they're coming to fight us. So, we will fight away. We will deploy all. We can't choose sides now, because we're, we're both coming to face each other. One of them is not fleeing, and there's nothing that needs capturing, so we can just let them have their fun. Um, they've got shields, remember, which is the good thing. I want to see what their mortars look like in combat, so I'm going to keep speed with one of them. That's the guy with the Vulcans, that's the guy without the Vulcans. They've also got missile racks, which will help out considerably. Alright, let's see what this looks look like in combat. Yeah, those are the mortars, see? Brilliant. Well done. Our ships have shields so they can keep themselves nice and done. Also, the uh, special ability of the um, Lasher classes is the uh, accelerated ammo feeders. They can increase the, their ballistic rate of fire considerably. Okay, we have a possible grab on a bustle cast, although we haven't got the marines to do it, so screw that. We will shoot them to pieces anyway. And we got a mauler. We got a mauler and two more Vulcan cannons. Fantastic news. That means we can equip... Where are we? We're over here. Let's go back to Corvus 2. We can equip our uh, other lasher with the Vulcan cannons at once as well. And what we're going to do is you going to have the Vulcan cannons there, uh, which we need to actually remove because we want to go to 8 and 3. Uh, Vulcan cannon, Vulcan cannon, but you can keep that as a light machine gun. Uh, I'm also going to alter those. Oops. Um, why? Because you give it, you give um, kinetic damage. So that you can actually be used slightly for shields. If worse, if worse comes to worse, you can attack some shields. It's not going to be great. It's going to be better for actually sticking with the uh, light auto cannon, actually. Yep, have that. Close support light auto cannon. Uh, weapon groups automate them. Which means you are there for attacking enemy shields. At good range, actually. 600 range. You can actually plink the way the shields quite nicely. And same thing with you. You're going to have the auto cannon there. Uh, weapon groups automate the weapon groups. Good. And that's everything fine. They're fine, they're fine, they're fine. That's where top speed slow down because their readiness is crap. But other than that, I think we can just sell some stuff now. What are we selling? What have we got to sell? I want to keep the weapons. Uh, let's keep some of the weapons. We can keep the heavy mauler, the Vulcan cannons, and the railgun. Uh, we can lose that, we can lose that, we can lose that. We can lose quite a lot of those supplies, actually. <laughs> yep, we got It's fine. Cool, we have almost 50,000 now. Which I think is a good place to end it. I'll go back to Corvus, drop off the gear we've got, and we have ourselves a little fleet now. An active little fleet that is doing quite well with itself. Uh, where's Corvus anyway? Oh crap, all the way over there. Uh, pirate plunder fleet has slavely delivered its goods and dispersed. So the pirate place might have some new stuff for us to try next time around. But we have our little fleet. We have a small little fleet. That will do its job nicely. Uh, here we can have have a railgun, have some Vulcans, have another antimatter, have a heavy molar. Sort you guys out. Good. These these to be fair, MRMs and machine guns they can go away. Everything else is worth keeping. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Right. That's it. That's it for this video, I think. And whoa, God, who's coming? Whoa, 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 whoa! 
next video we run away from these guys next video we will run away from these guys and stay alive anyway i'll catch you guys next time see ya